Hey everyone, it's the Slick Cuber. I just found this awesome V perm, and V perms used to be my least favorite PLL by far. The only PLL that comes close to annoying me as much as V perms is NB perms. So I just wanted to share this with you guys in case anyone else hasn't heard of this one yet. So most people for V-perm use the one with a Y rotation or with a Y D move. Uh, they're both basically the same algorithm. It just depends on whether you'd rather turn or do a Y D move. And the algorithm goes R prime U, R prime U prime, Y rotation, R prime F prime, R two U prime, R prime U, R prime F, R F. And that's what most people use. And honestly, that one's totally fine. I know there are a lot of people who can execute that really fast, especially people who are better at YD moves than I am. However, I just found that it was one of the more awkward PLLs to use. So when I discovered this alternate algorithm, I was really excited. It's actually kind of funny because this is the VPerm that I use in one-handed and I never once thought about using it in two-handed and I honestly don't know why. And I'm really frustrated with myself now that I've discovered it. Now the algorithm itself is very simple. All you're gonna do is R prime, U, R, U prime, a little like half rotation, U, then you're gonna do anti soon, so R, U2, R prime, U prime, R, U prime, R prime, then you're gonna do another U2 flick, and then you're gonna finish it off with a sexy move. And just like that, you have the V perm. Now unlike the first algorithm, there's no awkward Y rotations or Y D moves. Instead, all you have to do is one little tiny X rotation, but because of the way you put your hands, it's actually really easy. The way I finger trick this is start by re-gripping your hand like this. So your fingers are on the bottom and your thumbs on the top. This makes it really easy to do the R prime U, R U prime. And not only that, it also makes it really easy to do this X prime rotation because now all you're basically doing is re-gripping this left hand and twisting the cube a tiny bit so that it matches your right hand. It barely feels like a rotation at all because your right hand's already in the right position, you're just fixing your left hand. Not only that, but the next move is a U. So while you're doing this with your left hand, you can actually do the U move with your right hand. So we do the X prime and U at the same time, and then we do an anti soon. You do have to be pretty good at using your left fingers for U flicks or else this next part's gonna be kinda hard. But do anti soon like R, U2, R prime, U prime, R, U prime, R prime. And then you do another U2 with the same fingers and then do a sexy move. Now don't do a sexy move by re-gripping your hand like that. There's a way to do it without re-gripping at all. Simply move your finger right here and then kind of pinch it forward like that. So you're kind of like, you're kind of like pinching this top cube. You're gonna move it forward and you're gonna do the U and then bring it down and then finish it off. One more time, a little faster this time. Take your hand, re-grip it like this. R prime U, R U prime. Do this little half rotation and the U move at the same time. And then do anti soon, R, U2, R prime, U prime, R, U prime, R prime. Another U2 flick, and then finish it off with a sexy move. And just like that, it's done. Now I just learned this algorithm yesterday and it already flows so much nicer than my last one. I'm still not great at it, but I just learned it yesterday. I just had to record it right now and show you guys I just think that it's a much faster and much smoother VPerm algorithm than the one that I see most people using. Of course, this is all up to your own opinion. I'm sure there are other VPerms out there that you guys might like more. I'm sure there are a lot of you guys who actually like the rotation ones and are really fast at it. Use whichever VPerm you guys like the most. I just had to share this one. Thank you everyone for watching and I'll see you next time.